So I'm at work, and Rich is explaining. Rich, bro? Yeah, to Rob about why you have to get a stamp if and make adjustments to this weapon because of the ATF. And I already knew this stuff, but the more he's talking about it, the more I'm like, this is stupid. It's so dumb. And it's so just, oh, fuck it. The laws are fucking dumb. It's a money making scheme. And it's designed to keep us. Well, because you got to understand it's more lethal if you, if you have the weapon configured like this. And it's like, it's a fucking weapon. So let's go back to when this, the rules were made. The whole point was to be able to overthrow the government at a time if they were doing something that wasn't right. Yeah. It was cannons and muskets. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing. The founding fathers, I brought this up to you before, and I brought this up to a number of people where I've made this argument But not before. on podcast. The founding fathers owned wardships. Here's the other thing. A lot of people bring up, they talk about how rich the founding fathers were and how they were rich white men. Nah, guys. They went into fucking significant amounts of debt in order to make this shit happen. Yep. They were in debt for the rest of their lives to make this shit happen. Well, yeah, happen. George Washington could have just lived healthy off everything he made in England. Yeah. Like, what I I believe he was a very wealthy like, they officer all over there. They all were very wealthy individuals, either overseas or in, in the States, or and they fucking went into debt buying arms, fucking funding, yep. fucking everything, supplies, the whole nine. 